Okay, now we are going to look at another type of background. We already looked at the backdrop. Now we're going to look at the picture. So I'm going to make a new application, go to the frame editor on frame 1, and then I'm going to insert an object, and we have background selected, and as you can see there's picture. So when you press OK, it's gonna, and now we have this T as always, and now we're gonna click where we want it, and then a file selector is gonna come up. So we're just gonna choose a picture that we, because this is a picture object, so it's gonna access a picture file. So now we are going to double click here, and now we have this picture and as you can see it's very very large because it brings it in in the pixel dimensions now I'm gonna make this a lot smaller and now you can see we have this and we have all the these options for this picture the transparent and the ink effect like we saw before and the file name we can change there and then we can use all these different things there's alterable values and alterable strings and then events and we can change the name and get help here that's all for picture objects